Assalamu alaikum, it's Stu here and it's my first official video of cooking vegan food because I'm so good at it and I like doing it and you are going to have to accept that I'm going to do some stupid dad puns as well because I'm a dad but today I am going to show you how to make the vegan cauliflower buffalo wings what yes. these guys are amazing for making collie vegan wings um i'll do in a separate video whenever you've got cauliflower don't throw these away because you can bake these and they are like really nice as a side dish to eat they're so crispy and just oh they're so versatile but the wings today i'm going to show you how to do and oh my god you're gonna love it so first things first Make sure you've got cauliflower. Um, we've got some spices, we've got in there. Um, oh, look now, I'm gonna have to mess. So we've got ground pepper, we've got uh, onion granules, we've got cumin and we've got paprika and we've got salt. I think that's everything. And the secret to cauliflower buffalo wings, you can make it a ton of different ways but I like to use rice flour now normal all-purpose flour works some people like quinoa flour and a few different flours rice flour I found is the best thing to cook cauliflower in this so succulent and just they, it works really well as the batter so rice flour is the way to go now one sec I go to my Middle Eastern shop down the road in Warrington and I get this stuff, rice flour, and it is the bee's tethers. So rice flour for cauliflower wings. I've also got two cups of soya milk. I like to cook in cups because they're just easier to measure with. I do whey stuff as well and do it the English way, but the American cup system works really well for me. So. The cup system is pretty good if you're gonna watch my videos because that's how I do shiz. So I'm gonna stop the video, I'm gonna get all this riled up and I'll come back to you in just a tick. Right, so I had to re-angle the phone. Um, so I've got my rice flour now, dead simple. You're gonna pour all of your spices into the rice flour, put it all in there and give it a good I could stir around and get all of those um, spices and salt and pepper mixed into the rice flour as best as you can. Now, I'm making quite a large batch, so I've done two cups of rice flour and a teaspoon of each of the spices that I mentioned earlier, but I will obviously give the, uh, the recipe in the bit underneath. Um, so once they're all mixed in, you then pour the soya milk in. I've never really done it with any other milk apart from soy milk. Now this is sweetened soy milk, I guess. If you want to use non-sweetened, it's up to you. I've always used the sweetened soya milk. Um, and you just mix that in to make a batter. And I'm gonna mix that around and I'll come back to you in just a second. Right, so all of the uh, cauliflowers are battered now they've all been dipped in batter and dumped on I tend to like to use a baking sheet as well because I'm so lazy and I hate washing up and it's easy just to throw that damn thing away um, when you've cut the hearts out of the leaves don't throw the leaves away I'll show you in another video what to do with the leaves and you can bake them and with garlic and olive oil and stuff oh, it's just so good so do not throw the leaves away anyway I'm gonna stick that in the oven I'm gonna stop the video I'll get the stuff ready for the buffalo sauce and I'll come back to you in just a minute. So I'm just looking at the time and it's been about <laughs> a few seconds um, to melt the butter and the barbecue and it should just be very drippy drippy like that and I did go and get that out as well it's olive spread vegan olive spread so it was one cup of the barbecue sauce with 
four tablespoons of um, the olive spread, but you can use Vitalite or just pure. I think Flora have even got a vegan version of what they're doing now to get into the vegan market. So once you've melted that butter down with the spread, it's then again one of these jobbies get it in there now you could use tongs i'm probably going to burn my fingers to show you this because i haven't got them out yes um and then you just dip it in and stick it back on the baking tray that is the deal with this man it's all about the dippage so ah, that's hot i can't get it out now darn darn so that's it again and it's just continued dippage of the um of the collie wings into the barbecue sauce once you've dipped all them you stick it back in the oven um and so basically that's set so it could be anything from 10 minutes to 15 or 20. um the original batter went in for about 15 minutes or so you put them in again for around the same time it might even be less depending on the type of oven you've got i never put set times because every oven and every cook time is different depending on the batter consistency on your sauce consistency um, and everything in between so um, yes I will come back in two secs right I'm about to take out the um, cauliflower wings out of the oven and I'm hoping that they are freaking awesome because I've made a video and it's my first video although it's probably all over the place but however it's done oh steam my glasses up anyway look at them babies so always use oven gloves stew's top tip of the day so these are the cauliflower barbecue cauliflower buffalo wings now these go great with you can make you can like whack it with rice or even just chips man but you can do it with celery sticks and carrot sticks um, I tend to like to make my own um, vegan ranch now obviously you can dip your collie wings into anything that you so wish to do so um, it's really easy to make uh, vegan ranch you need a vegan mayonnaise I tend to eat like vegan A's which you can buy at Sainsbury's um, whack it with a bit of soya milk and some dill I don't know if you can see the dill in there or not a little bit of a pinch of onion powder onion powder a uh, bit of salt bit of pepper there's a few different ways to do it to be fair if you're not gonna buy the, the proper I don't even know if there is a proper ranch that's vegan uh, in the UK but that is definitely the way to make it veganized in the in the UK. I'm sure there's a vegan version in the US. If I've got any US followers. So I'm gonna whack it with some ranch. That's my wife shouting at the kids if you can hear that in the background. Um, so onwards and upwards, I'm gonna see if I can. I don't know if I can grab one of these shit like too hot so I'm gonna give it a go but oh god they look so good man look so that's kind of all golden and crystallized and just juicy and sweet barbecue and that's how it should really look there should be nothing dripping off it at the end I show you a bigger one a bit of a blackened one but it looks so whoops it's so succulent and soft it's fell off the fork um so these are the collie wings man um so i'm gonna see there's another one there. look at that bad boy anyway i'm gonna dip this badger into my vegan ranch so 
Uh, there we go. It's just bloody fell in now as well. Anyway, let's give this a go. Oh, it's hot. Oh. oh my god, how can people not be vegan when there's this food that's available to us all? <sighs> now, this isn't just for vegans. Anybody can make this and enjoy it. It's such amazing food. That, I've just outdone myself with that. That is better than the last batch I made a few weeks ago. Oh my gosh. I am seriously contemplating not to share this with the kids. Because that is darn good. So, there you go. Vegan collar wings. Easy to do. I think I've shown you step by step how to do it. Um, if you've got any questions, message me. Really, really simple to do. You can whack it with anything. You can mess around with rice and make Cajun rice or spicy rice or whatever. You could could do it with, with chips, as I've said. You can do it dead standard with some carrot sticks and stuff as a sideline snack. You can make the sauce spicy and put sweet chili in there or other types of sauces to whack it with, like. Um, different spicy glazes and whatnot but at the end of the day it's such a simple recipe and it costs next to nothing man it costs next to nothing it's two cauliflowers essentially and some sauces mixed together so enjoy i will see you on my next video don't throw the collie leaves away because i'll show you what to do with them next time just knocked that out of the back My name's Stu, thank you for watching, barbecue, buffalo, cauliflower, wings, give it a go, super duper, let me know if you try it, how you get on, um, and if you change anything or make something a little bit different, as long as it's vegan, because if it's not, I'm not interested, um, but yeah, let me know how you get on, super duper nice, the family will love it. The kids will love dipping their, their cauliflower in the batter sauce and the barbecue sauce and getting all messy and bleh. So give it a go and I will see you on the next video.